We're here with Trek Chats, your internet source for the offbeat, fan-based news you crave about the Star Trek series. Beaming you behind-the-scenes facts, expert opinions, and fascinating ideas about the planet's most renowned science fiction show. We asked Larry if he thinks there's much chance we'll be seeing a Star Trek series on our TV screens again. Well, I think right now it's like a lot of things with government. I think the people are ahead of the powers that be, only in this case we're just talking about how Hollywood powers that be. I think the meme was unfairly when Enterprise was canceled that people thought that Star Trek was uh, tired and dated and all that, where I think maybe the production team was a little tired, more so than the demand, because about the time Enterprise was, you know, stri- and, and they still had ratings better than tons of shows on TV the last few years of, of Enterprise, even the last series. I think just, just corporately, there's no one in charge of Star Trek. J.J. Abrams and Bad Robot have the movie franchise, but it's clearly a movie where you get two hours every three or four years, and it's blockbuster. And, you know, Star Trek movies have always, they're not like James Bond or Star Wars. The Star Trek movies have always been, uh, I say, icing on the cake. They've always been like a reward for a cast and an audience alike after they've gone through and built up as a series and people know them. And you, it's almost like the reward of a format and the budget of a movie to tell bigger stories you could ever do on TV. So, just saying, I'm going to do Star Trek movies. I mean, you know, JJ's movies are, ca- are characters we know, even though they're tweaked by being alternate universe. New cast, but the characters in the universe. We know. So, people, I, I, you know, the, the thing that's, that JJ was great about doing was bringing in a whole new generation, a younger generation that's used to seeing things a certain way, coming in through, you know, video games and digital online and, and having. Your, your life out there 24 <laughs> 7 on social media and that vestige of Star Trek being this old thing from the 60s 70s 80s 90s is sure blown away and people are figuring out that they really miss having a weekly series so I think it's percolating I think the powers that be the way Hollywood works although we've had this digital blow up the fan films are huge right now all over the place I just got to be in one um, that's showing that there's as much grassroots support. People are, you know, as interested in the online games. Uh, the universe isn't, the Star Trek sandbox isn't going anywhere. The, the world that Gene, you know, launched and kickstarted um, in the 60s is still got appeal to people. It's not going anywhere. As long as the core, you know, Roddenberry vision is at the core of it. respect and infinite diversity and good combination and we will have a future and we'll inherently be positive and that there's more good in people than bad, including the things we need out there, there will be more good than bad. I mean, even the Klingons turned around, came around and you know, we still have hope for those Romulans and uh, <laughs> so it's just a it's just a bureaucratic thing right now. There will be a Star Trek is too Star Trek is too big an economic thing. It used to be that it was like you'd fight the big bad accountants, but everybody knows that Star Trek makes money on the commercial level. So as long as it's done well, everybody can be happy. The the pure of heart looking for inspiration and great entertainment. And uh, the guys in Hollywood wanting to, you know, make a buck and and, um, and know that if they get somebody good to be in charge uh, it'll continue the Roddenberry legacy. And by now, nobody wants to, you know, screw up the Roddenberry legacy and the legacy of Star Trek. So it's such a magic word to so many people wanting to jump in and do their best on, on an industry side. And audiences expect so much. Uh, it'll, it'll happen. It's just not happening right now.